What's up guys, it's Elliot with Arbo Space. Today we're gonna to be talking a bit about the ISC Apex, the chipmunk tether, and the squirrel tether. So the ISC Apex comes with a lot of cool features. It is a midline attachable wrench. Uh, you simply open it just by, and collapse it by pushing this pin in and sliding it open and then closing it. Um, the ISC Apex comes with an adjustable friction level. As you can see on this side, you can adjust it to level one, two, three, or four. Um, to adjust the friction, it's very simple and user-friendly. All you do is take this pin and lift it up and twist it to your desired friction level based on the diameter of your rope or construction of your rope. I personally like to run mine on level one. Um, as you can see, it's very simple to open and close, so to reattach it, I just slide my rope in between the wrench there, flip this back over, and close it. Um, the pin on this is recessed, so if you are in a position where you might be rubbing up against some branches or the trunk of the tree, it's very difficult to collapse that pin for that to open. As you can see, looking at it from this angle, that pin does not stick out at all. Um, with the chipmunk, I found that it's best to run this with a 26 or 28 inch pressic right here. I'm using our 8 millimeter Jupiter pressic that we make here at Arbo Space, and I'm demonstrating this on our 11.7 Aspen. Um, so this overall, this is a really great combo with this rope and pressic. As you can see, that it's very smooth on your ascent as well as your descent. Very very smooth piece of equipment here um, with the. ISC Squirrel, obviously that's a bit of the longer tether, so you can run really any length pressic you want, you know, 30, 32, whatever your desire is. Um, with the Chipmunk, I like to kind of tie a pressic that's nice and tight and collapsed, so I have room to fit my hand in there to collapse it. Um, one of the major benefits to the Chipmunk is just with it being so short on your ascent as you're grabbing the rope as you're tending yourself, um, you really, your hands don't really get in the way of the wrench itself, so it's real nice and smooth, super easy to use and user friendly. If you've been using the standard rope wrench for a long time, it'll be a super easy transition for you to go from that to this. And this is just a little bit of an upgrade, a little more versatile with the additional friction or less friction, whichever one you choose. So uh, check it out on the website, and I think you guys will enjoy it. Thanks, guys.